excitement in the air after learning a familiar name in fast food is now just days away from returning. Local 12's James Pilcher shows us what to expect from the return of the iconic Roy Rogers brand. Roy Rogers, the famous cowboy actor and singer, was born more than 100 years ago, about 20 miles east of here in downtown Cincinnati. Now, more than a decade after disappearing, the restaurant bearing his name is coming back to the area. Becky Shelton is with One Holland, the franchisee relaunching Roy Rogers here in Cleves on February 27th. It's already crazy exciting. Um, people not just are talking about it, people are posting things on social media. Um, yesterday, as we're setting the store up, a gentleman brought his horse here to Roy's and came through the drive through Indeed, area resident Bill Tittle showed up this week with his horse, telling managers it was a bucket list event for him, as shown here in pictures provided by One Holland. Rogers was born in 1911 on 2nd Street in Cincinnati, where Riverfront Stadium was eventually built. His family moved to Portsmouth and then Lucasville before he became a star in the 1930s, eventually appearing in more than 100 movies and a well-known TV show. The original chain began in Virginia in 1968, undergoing a major rebranding recently. The last restaurant in the tri-state where Rogers' name closed 10 years ago in Anderson Township, so Shelton expects a big rush on opening day. I know there will be people lined up, just like when they closed the last Roy's in Mount Carmel. There were people lined up for hours. If you're a fan of the restaurant chain from across the river in northern Kentucky, take heart. A new location is set to open in Florence sometime this summer. In Cleves, James Pilcher, Local 12 News. You can go buy cars. They accept anyone at that drive through Now, Roy Rogers became known for its roast beef sandwiches, burgers and fried chicken. And the menu board, we got a sneak peek, shows the same familiar items at that new location. One Holland plans to open at least 10 new Roy Rogers restaurants throughout the tri-state in the next few years.